Hello, this is Krillian, and welcome to episode 25 of my Let's Play uh, Mass Effect 2 as Krillian Shepard, a vanguard on insanity difficulty. Um, we're getting quite a bit of things. Last time we completed what's like the third to halfway point. Um, so we are moving along quite quickly. Uh, weapon upgrades. What can we get? Nothing. Armor upgrades. Body damage. We searched that. I kind of wish it didn't kick you out. Doesn't let me get anything else. Uh, we don't want the ship enhancement yet. Um, heavy weave. Definitely want that. And just check to make sure there's not something else we can get. Oh, heavy bone weave. That's amazing. 50% less damage will be really great against uh, husks and BC more husks. We'll start by talking to Morden. Shepard, how can I help? Let's talk. Have you got a minute to talk? Having trouble working between your interruptions and Edie's insistence that insane experiments endanger entire crew. Hard to concentrate. Affecting morale. Anything else? Nobody else. I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Apparently he's not ready to give me his mission yet. What about you, Jacob? Commander, sorry I'm a little unfocused. Personal matter. It won't affect my duties. What's on your mind? Always have time for my crew. What is it? As I said, it's a personal matter. I don't want to waste our time if it turns out to be a goose chase. But... Well, I got pinged by a ghost the other night. Family. Hmm. A ghost, huh? I'm listening. My private log got an update about the Hugo Gerns back. The ship my father served on. It sent an SOS last week, reporting a crash and requesting a rescue. Shepard, that ship went missing ten years ago. I hadn't talked to my father for three years before that. I've buried everything but a body. I'm not convinced it isn't just some automated distress signal ticking over. It's been too long. Do you want to find him? I think you'd be more excited that your father might be alive. He wasn't around enough for me to have bad memories. It's an old, well-healed wound. But if he's actually alive and needs help... I also want to note that it's not normal procedure for distress calls to be routed to the Normandy. This was passed to my personal log through Cerberus filters. So, Cerberus may now? Any signs that this was a Cerberus front? Who passed this to you? I doubt the elusive man would let a direct operation stake hold this long. If there's a link, it's probably just about money. Cerberus needs diverse holdings to fund projects like, well, you. And whoever sent this my way covered their tracks. Someone could be fishing for favors, or thought it would get under my skin. Who knows with that bunch? Uh, how close were you to your father? You didn't get along with your father? He made no apologies, I'll give him that. You make a mistake, you own up to it. Even if you keep making it. Whatever problems we had were a lifetime ago. I've had ten years to get to where I am. And as far as I know, he's still a ghost. What was the Gernsback? Tell me about the Hugo Gernsback and what it was doing. Privately held frigate. I looked over the mission brief when it disappeared. Nothing stood out. Typical research and grab operation. Find an uncharted planet, stake a claim, and establish as large a presence as you can as fast as possible to shut out competitors. Okay, we'll go Lick. I think we can spare the time. Pass the coordinates to Joker. I appreciate that, Commander. I don't expect more than dusty old bones, but it'll be good to close the record. Okay. So I think that's everything he has to say for now, probably. We have our third, I guess, um, mission from a crew member. We still need to do Zaids. We've already taken care of uh, um, Kusami. Hey, Commander. It's uh, pretty crazy the people you can run into out here, huh? I mean, it was probably a setup or something, but it was still good to see Ash, Operations Chief Williams, wasn't it? Yeah, I think we're still friends. She moved on. I can't blame her. 
She was frontline with you blowing up half the Citadel, and I'm the one who gets roped back into saving the galaxy? But did somebody switch our files? You're the force that pulls it all together, Joker. Yeah, it sucks. I'll give you that. How are things? I assume everything is going well up here? Quiet enough. I... What the... Trouble? No, it's nothing. I... <sighs> Son of a... Very funny, Edie. Real original. Stop it. You did insist on manual control, Mr. Moreau. Uh, tell me about what you think of the squad. What do you think about the people we're picking up? Well, about the ones you went out with last. Grunt is... Not a stabilizing element, Commander. I like Kasumi, but why do I feel like I need to check the Citadel for parts she may have pawned? It's just my opinion, though. There's really no need to go spreading it around. Okay. Adios. That's it for now. See you, Commander. Okay. Um, let's check in with Kelly. See what she might have to tell us. I saw the reports on Horizon, Commander. What you did was amazing. The report mentioned that Ashley Williams was there. How did that go? Uh, it went okay. It was good to see her. Do you have strong feelings for her? Uh, are you jealous? Would it bother you if I did, Kelly? No, I'm just making sure my commander isn't going bonkers. It's not like I'm trying to be a friend. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? Apparently... Moment to talk. I always have time for you, Commander. Apparently not. Go. Okay, maybe we'll talk later. I was honestly done. How's How true? may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Operative Lawson would like to see you at her station on the crew deck. Anything else, Commander? Nope. That'll be all. So I apparently we can get... Apparently we can get lost in um, crew mission two. I'm gonna go to my cabin first, because we have priorities. Before I see Miranda, we're gonna go feed my fish and check email. All the important things. Okay, wander this way. Make sure the fish are eating away. Looking good. Check on our space hamster. Okay. Incoming message from Admiral Stephen Hack at Alliance HQ. Dude likes to talk. Commander, thank you for your time. I'll keep this brief. We have a deep cover operative out in Batarian space. Name's Dr. Amanda Kenson. Dr. Kenson recently reported that she found evidence of an imminent Reaper invasion. So why call me? Just this morning I received word that the Batarians arrested her. They're holding her in a secret prison outpost on terrorism charges. I need you to infiltrate the prison and get her out of there. As a favor to me, I'm asking you to go in alone. Well, that's pretty big. Uh, you want me to go alone? That's dangerous. I have a hell of a squad with me. I'm sure they'd help out. Kenson is my friend. If the Batarians see a squad of armed soldiers, they'll kill her. This is serious, Commander. Go in with discretion, or don't go at all. Tell me about these charges. What is Dr. Kenson actually doing out there? She's a deep cover operative, Shepard. We talk only when we have to. I'd heard she was investigating a rumor of a Reaper artifact in the system. Her last report said she'd found it. Um... Tell me about her. What else can you tell me about the operative? Amanda's a top scientist and an Alliance agent working in Batarian space. It's a deadly assignment, and she's one of the few up to the challenge. She and I go back pretty far, Commander. I won't let her run away in a Batarian torture camp. What about the invasion? I thought the Alliance denies the Reaper threat. That must be some proof she found. Kenson's team found an artifact out in Batarian space. She believes it's a Reaper device, proof that the Reapers are indeed planning to invade. I've known her a long time. If she says she has proof, it's worth checking out. How are, how are the Batarians doing with us? The Batarians won't take kindly to the Alliance breaking into a secret prison. This is not an Alliance operation. It's one person going in alone to save a friend. If it were an official mission, of course the Batarians would be upset. You keep this quiet, Shepard, and there's nothing to worry about. I'll save her, dude. I'll make this a priority. The prison is hidden underground in a Batarian outpost in Aratat. 
I'll upload the coordinates now. Once she's secure, confirm her discovery. We'll debrief you when you're back. Got it. Hack it out. Okay. What other unread messages do we have? The Alliance soldier here gave me this contact information from Robin Wee Reeve. I hope it reaches you. you. You said you were trying to stop those collectors. They had took my son and my brother. Have you found them? Do you know where they are? I know you're looking, but so many people are just gone. Every family lost someone. The children are the worst. Empty deaths at the school where it went to close it up and never got warned. Please, the Alliance isn't doing anything and the Council isn't doing anything. If you can find the people, I'm begging you to do something. Tell me something I can do. Uh, sorry, Robin. And limits what I can tell you. We're trying. We're aware that your old friend the Earth Sony has been hunting for the, for the Shadow Book for several years. We wouldn't mind helping her in that hunt given the broker's past work for the Collectors. Recently uncovered some information that might give Liara a lead on where to find the Shadow Broker's base of operations. Unfortunately, she doesn't have much faith in Cerberus Intel. If you'll visit Ilium and pass it on to her as the Treasure of Goodwill, we'd appreciate it. Okay, you can do that. Okay. I'm gonna go down to the crew quarters next. I don't think Garrus would give me his stuff either. It is convenient if he would. We are going to go after that um, Kenson, but it'll be a while. That'll be one of the later missions. It is quite difficult anytime you have to go in alone. So, I want to be as powerful as possible. Let's see if they have any news for me. I just got a message from my wife. I've been listening to my daughter's giggle over and over. <laughs> That's so cute. When this mission is over, I'm going to give her the longest hug she's ever had. Cool. You get him back home so we can do that. Let's go see if Kasumi has anything interesting to tell us. Hey, Shepard. I usually travel hidden away in cargo bays. It's nice to be able to look out a window for a change. Mess Sergeant Gardner might just be an evil genius. Emphasis on the evil. The food's gotten better lately, though. I guess his reputation will take time to heal. Hey. I'm not really sure what to do with myself. Not much call for thievery aboard a ship. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. Yes, please do not thieve things from my ship. Okay. Wander over. Say hi to Miranda. Apparently she has things to tell me. Shepard, I find myself in the unpleasant position of asking for your help. I don't like discussing personal matters, but this is important. Of course. Miranda, you're one of my crew. Tell me what's on your mind. You remember what I told you about Father? Building a dynasty? There was another reason I went to Cerberus for protection. I have a sister, a twin, and he's still hunting her. Cerberus has kept her safe until now. She's living a normal life on Ilium, safe and hidden from my father. Only well, not so much anymore, huh? So you think your father has tracked her down? Precisely, Commander. My sources indicate he knows that she's on Ilium. I've tried to keep her hidden without impacting her life, but I'm out of options. He's too close. I need to relocate my sister's family before it's too late. Tell me about your sister. What do you know about your sister? She's my genetic twin. We're identical. But she deserves a normal life, and she's going to get it no matter what. Where we relocate her? Does your sister's family know about this? Are they okay with being relocated? They know nothing. They're completely uninvolved. Normal. I told Cerberus, and they're coming up with a positive reason to move the family. We can do this. What do you need me to do? My father is extremely persistent. I'd like to go to Ilium when Cerberus is moving the family to make sure none of his agents get too close. My contact's name is Lantea. She'll be waiting for us in the lounge near the Nurse Astra docking bay. Don't worry, we got this. I wonder if she has anything else to talk about. If we have time, I'd like to go to Ilium and relocate my sister's family. What are you looking for? Can you tell me more about relocating your sister? My father is after my sister. 
I've kept her hidden for years, but his agents have tracked her to Ilium. I need to help her. You remember what I told you about father? Building a dynasty? There was another reason I went to Cerberus for protection. Oh, we've already got all this. I have a sister, a twin, and he's still hunting her. Cerberus has kept her safe until now. She's living a normal life on Ilium, safe and hidden from my father. Not so much anymore, because you've so already you told me this. Her down. I'm gonna go a little faster this I've because to keep her without... we can help. What do you need me to do? My father, my contact's name is Lantea. Okay, that's fine. We got what we needed from there. Let's Weren't see. If... you originally stationed on Horizon? Yes. If I hadn't joined Cerberus, I'd be abducted by the Collectors right now. Wow, it really does the bullet. Okay, Garrus, do we get your stuff? Shepard, need me for something? Let's talk. Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibration. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. For like my best intergalactic bud, he really doesn't like to talk to me. I think Dr. Chakras is a better intergalactic bud sometimes. Sadly, she never picks up a gun and goes to town. Okay, uh, down to engineering for what we can get here. I don't think we'll get anything from uh, the others, but we'll see. I will get my um, max out rank of uh, whatever, Biotic Warrior, whatnot. Oh, let's go say hi to Jack. She may actually have things to tell me. Her conversations move at a very different pace. Hey. Let's talk. Tell me something I don't know about you. Nothing to tell. Why? I'm curious. I want to know more, and I'm not going away. I'm here to fight for you. Nothing says we have to be friends, but whatever. Something you don't know, huh? Obvious stuff, like what's up with my ink, or something else just as boring. You're not really interested unless it affects you. I've been through all this shit before. And what if I do care? I could be genuine. You have no way of knowing. I have eyes, and I have history. You'll back off. As soon as you realize you're not the first, and I'm immune to your help. Tell me about the tattoos. Oh, right. What's with the tattoos? Some are for prisons I've been in. Some are for kills. You know, good ones. Some are for things I've lost. Those aren't your business. They're nobody's business. And some are because, hey, why the fuck not? So you never have close relations. You work pretty Chips. hard at not letting people get close. I've been with lots of people. If you're asking about a boyfriend or a girlfriend, no. It's a waste of time and it never works. You let someone get that close, it just means they need a shorter knife. Lonely and alive works just fine, thanks. You said lonely. Yeah, sorry, you, you must have friends. We'll do this You're one tough. first. But you can't have survived alone all these years. When I was starting out, I ran with this girl, Manara, and her boyfriend. They knew their way around. I thought they'd help me. Right. They helped me into their bed. And when we finally did take down something big, they helped themselves to my share of the take. I knew where it was heading. And I got them first. Never bothered with friends after that. I want to do you this one. Because I want to say you said lonely. They need a shorter knife. Lonely and alive works just fine. Thanks. Seems like you miss it a little more than you want to admit. Pick every little word apart if you want, but it doesn't change the way the galaxy works. Come on, you've been around. I will go through this Some one again. Some prisons I've been in. Some are for kills. You know. Apparently we can't jump through this one quickly. Some are for things I've lost. Those aren't your business. They're nobody's business. And some are because, hey, why the fuck not? Okay, so we'll have to do this one. But you can't yeah, I knew where it was heading, and I got them first. So you positive they would kill you? with friends after that. They sound like selfish pricks. That doesn't mean they were going to kill you. I get feelings. I don't need proof. I did the smart thing. I always do the smart thing if people fuck with me. That's probably something you should remember. Yeah, I don't. I think I can take you. I have to go, but we should do this again. Wait. My turn with the questions. People usually walk by now. Why are you really asking all these things? Are you eyeing me up? Because if this is just about sex, maybe you should just fucking say so. 
Nah, I just want to know you. I'm in no hurry. I want to know what makes you tick first. You don't need to know someone to sleep with them. You just have to know where to put it. Okay. Maybe we'll talk later. Maybe not. Okay. What do we have here? Rupert is actually cooking some good meals lately. Yeah, right. That scunner couldn't serve a good haggis if his life depended on it. But all haggis tastes like ass anyway. Aye, but in the right hands, it could taste like mighty fine ass. Uh, I'll take your word for it. Okay, we're almost through the this, and then we'll pick where we want to go next. Shepard. What's up? Just checking in, making sure you're acclimatizing. The hold is too open. Not enough cover. Armor is limited. Warlord Granth would target here to scatter heavy cargo, then focus on engines. That's what tank imprints show about human ships, anyway. It's how I learned from the tank. Old pictures where memory is. Like holding a book for a child. Just remember this picture after picture. No help with finding a reason to care. Anything else about humans? What other human info was floating around in there? Less than a finger deep to sever your spine. You're soft. Salarians, Asari, all soft. Quarians, not so much. Turians, you have to work the blade, I guess. Don't see much point to it, though. <laughs> much point. <laughs> ah, never mind. So you have no reaction to this? Something must move you. You're as genetically Krogan as you can get. I see suffering, the dead, and I think weak. I'm supposed to be strong. My guts were grown from thousands more worthy. The dead were weak. If they were strong, I wouldn't be needed. I don't know why Okir started teaching. When he turned on the tank the first time, I screamed. Weak. Pitiful. And yet you're strong now. So you started small. But you became what you are. Not everyone gets that chance. I'm built for strength, but didn't earn it. I just am. Those dead were strong enough to try, even if they lost. The perfect Krogan, ignoring what made me. No strength in that. I'll take another look at what happened to the Krogan. Find a reason to care about it. Kind of sad, really. He was born with all this knowledge and theory and none of it's practical. That would be kind of depressing. Okay, what's up, Zaid? Back for another lesson. Tough fight on Horizon. I fought slavers and kidnapping rings, but nothing like that. Some slavers took a little girl on a colony in the Skepsis system. Girl woke up, fought her way out, got picked up by my band while on her way to Omega. Interesting. She'd have had no chance on Horizon. That is very true. Get a knife stuck in the right way, and you can pull that plate right off a Krogan's head. It's oh. the best way to get a Krogan to talk. The threat of it drives him mad. I'll take your word for it. I should let you go. Talk more later, Shepard. Yeah, I don't find Zaid as interesting or as consuming. Oh well. Let's go pick our next locale. So, we have another three or four allies to pick up. Plus, we have a couple of uh, DLC missions uh, that we need to handle. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Really? I thought I just read all of them. No, we don't. You're lying to me. Bad secretary. Psychologist, helmsman, person. Okay. Okay, let's go. Um, we have other things that we can do because we do want to take the time to do all of these, even if it's just very brief. Oh, there we go. Probe away. 
we'll call that good. It was rich, we could have picked up more, but I don't really want to spend all mission focusing on this. Oh. This one has Eva, Iza. I can't the rich planet have Iza. Okay. Go with that. I think that's all we're gonna do. Then we have one more and we're done in this area. I really don't get why Ashley starts like throwing around Cerberus is behind us when Cerberus sent me to stop it. Although I guess Cerberus did kind of like get her sent to that world. But if she had not been, like the whole world would have been uh, pretty much destroyed. Plot the mass relay jump. Okay. So we can help Saeed over here. Here we can get the Justicar. The Assassin, Miranda, and Liara. We have a production line. We can help Jacob. Oh, we're still doing Tali first. Now this one can also be kind of difficult. But we're going to definitely get our good pal Tali back. Is there not a fuel station here? Let me see how much we have to deal with outside. Oh, we are very low on fuel. That's okay. And the orbit. That works. Getting that back up a little bit. Again, at this point. Oh, that was really it? Nothing else here? Okay. We'll have enough to get back, but it'll be bare. 66 fuel left. We really need more fuel. Okay, here, into the orbit. That's good. We don't have over 100,000 palladium anymore, so upping the palladium works. The orbit. Scan this. Ooh, Iza. On a rich world. We will... We'll do that one. It had two resources that we needed. Wow, look at that one. Launching Pro. We're about to have more ease of than, um. Oh, why not have that? Launched. Next place we go will need to be a place that we can buy stuff. Broke away. Did that give me Iza? It did. Probe away. We have more Iza than Palladium. Do that and then we'll call it a day. Okay. So we're going to Heistrom. Entering the orbit. Formerly a Korean colony, it was established to observe the phenomena of Dolan, the system's parent star. It appears to be unstable with a high possibility of erupting prematurely into a red giant. Exhausted the Geth. Today, spy probe scans indicate extensive orbit of construction around Heistrom, housing thousands of Geth platforms. Uh. So be very careful. Sure. Okay. We'll pick our crew. 
get down to Haystorm and then end. We are playing against Geth. What do I want to bring? Uh, Geth do a lot of cover stuff. Kasumi works well for that, so we're going to add her. And then... Do you want to do Miranda or Garrus? I'm going to bring Miranda. She has Overload and Warp, which will be really useful. And so we're going to bring two Overloads, uh, her fist thing, etc. Now we get to do some level ups. I'm going to do Assault Mastery. Um, probably go Destroy a little bit. Let's look. Okay, so we have destroyed your weapons and picked even more damage, and we receive a damage bonus of biotic powers. So we have plus 70% renegade paragon points, and minus 9 recharge time, 15 health, 15 weapon damage, and 15 power damage. Or we can do your staying power, lets you survive marathons of combat. Power recharging time of paragon renegade scores are improved still further, and you receive a bonus of biotic duration. Uh, I don't really have a lot of duration powers. Weapon damage will only be 9, health is plus 20%. Um, I think we're going Destroyer, though. Although we're going Paragon. Champion would be the more Paragon thing sounding. Destroyer is just the better one. Okay. Kasumi, you definitely get this. Okay, you have uh, increased the damage inflicted on the target, so this is 550 damage with 7 second incapacitation. That's pretty good. Uh, reduces the cooldown by 80% if the target is killed. You don't necessarily use it to kill. Um, and not only does 450, I'd rather the extra 100 damage. We have to use it to blow through things. Miranda, you have three points. Uh, just go ahead and get the Cerberus Officer. You give squad health and squad damage, which is pretty good. Okay. So. Do I want to keep the particle accelerator, the particle beam? Um, uh, I would say that it's failed with enough research. Now we maybe able to produce more beam parts on a larger scale. That would be kind of cool. It's very effective. We'll keep it. I really don't find any others too amazing. If all the bugs burn like that, you wouldn't think too many would exist. If the tally is somewhere in these ruins, there is considerable geth activity and an environmental hazard. Solar output has overwhelmed Haystrom's protective magnetosphere. Exposure to direct sunlight will damage your shields. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and end the video here, like and subscribe, and we'll be back with episode 26 next time, which will be pretty heavy on the fighting as we go save Tali. Adios.